three, two, one, zero. Ignition and lift off. Well, did you happen to catch this site before the Space Coast overnight? NASA and SpaceX launching the Crew 4 mission. The astronauts expected to arrive tonight about 8.15 at the ISS. So they've got a long journey today. Fox 35 News is live team coverage. Amanda McKenzie standing by after watching the launch alongside some dedicated fans. And also Alina Shirazi. She is there at Kennedy Space Center this morning where it just never gets old, Alina, does it? It's always just a beautiful thing to watch. Yes, it is. It is always a beautiful thing to watch. And we've seen a few of these crude launches. And I can tell you, everyone is just a bit as exciting as the last. We just saw the latest generation of astronauts blast off into the space, currently en route to the International Space Station. They blasted off in a Falcon 9 rocket with a brand new capsule called Freedom. And hours ago, we watched the crew get suited up and strapped into the capsule with smiles on their faces, ready for, again, their historic mission to the ISS. NASA says Crew 4 is the fourth crew rotation mission with the SpaceX Crew Dragon spacecraft in the company's fifth ever crewed flight to the ISS with NASA's commercial crew program, with the first being Demo 2 with Bob Banken and Doug Hurley back in 2020. We interviewed NASA's administrator and former Senator Bill Nelson. We asked him if he ever thought there would be this much activity on the coast. He says, in short, yes. I actually predicted some of these things that will happen. I didn't know, of course, that it's going with the frequency and the rapidity that we see. I mean, we have a traffic jam over here at the Cape uh, that we are having to uh, let one rocket launch or one rocket uh, spacecraft come down and splash down in order for the other one to go up. And Crew 4 should reach the International Space Station by 8.30 p.m. tonight. There they'll be conducting over 200 science experiments during their six-month stay at the International Space Station. For now, we're live at Kennedy Space Center. Alina Shirazi, Fox 35 News. Alina, good stuff.